for today, we are gonna go on a nature walk, which we love, and find some things that we are gonna use throughout the tree study. I brought with me this little bag. It's also recyclable, as you can see. And come with me and we are gonna fill it up with what we find. So let's go. I'm passing these two trees. Which one looks taller, this one or this one? I'm gonna go with that guy. <laughs> this is from the pine tree right here. It fell off, it was on the ground, so I picked it up. You wanna be extra careful if you find these though. These could be very sharp. So just be careful and yell out to mom and dad if you find one of these. Here's another one, like the brown one I found. This one happens to be what color? Green. So I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna throw it into my bag. I'm loving the green grass. You can skip, you can walk, you can run and explore. Found this and how cool is this? This is a piece of bark. It's super cool. You can feel it and see if it's rough or smooth. So I'm gonna take this and also put it my bag. Finding a lot of these on my neighborhood walk. If you do too, you can use it in your bag or even take it and if it happens to have the branch, you can use it as a paintbrush, which is super fun. Okay, so now I am home safe. I have all my goodies in here from my nature walk. You're gonna wanna hold on to everything because we have activities such as sorting to do tomorrow. But I'm gonna show you a way that you can explore what you found now and it will be fun. Okay, so with me and my bag stuff, I happen to have a big Tupperware. If you don't mind getting it dirty, awesome for a sensory bin, water play, sand, drawing letters, really good to use. Or you, if you don't mind using your paper towel to lay everything out, awesome too. I'm gonna go with the Tupperware. Just gonna take all my bag and shake it. You could even put your hand in. Like I said though, if you collected something a little sharp, be careful, kind of guess what it is. If not, take it, pour it in there. There's gonna be dirt, so like I said, going, oh, you don't mind getting it dirty. I dropped a rock. Get that Hot mess. <laughs> and now I have created a sensory bin. So in here I can explore everything that I found, take a look, look at it more closely. Um, again, we're gonna be using these materials tomorrow also, so hold on to them. So if you have a magnifying glass, that would be really cool to look at everything. Maybe you could sit, this is a great time to do math, count how many items you have found. Maybe mom or dad, if you take something away, how many are left. Um, and then if you don't have a magnifying glass, let me just show you. You could use your phone or iPad. And you can go through, you could stand up, and you could use your camera like a magnifying glass and kind of zoom in on everything 
and you can be your own nature explorers and check out what you found. And we can't wait to, to see what you guys find on your nature walk. Hopefully you find a little bit more green than I do. Maybe some flowers, maybe different kinds of sticks, different kinds of leaves. Maybe you'll find pine cones also. So check it out and see what you find. I cannot wait to see. I hope you enjoyed this activity. Hope it was fun. Remember, if you don't do this, it's okay. Just hold on to your stuff. Um, or if you want to go on another nature walk that morning and find some new stuff, that works. So can't wait. Have fun, guys. Get outside and explore.